Are you kidding me? It's me, it's me, it's Driver 53. Welcome back everybody to another episode of the Farming Battle Royale. That's right, we're down to just about four hours left in this competition, y'all. Guess what I'm going to be doing today? That's right, I'm cutting down Christmas trees. No, it's, it's just regular trees. But I'm going to pretend they're Christmas trees, because it's Christmas, y'all. Gotta get in the spirit. So I'm going to be playing some music for you today to help you through the next couple weeks until the big man shows up at your house. Now i got a question for you. What's the most trees you've ever cut down on your property? Me? Right now, it's like 117. That's the most I've ever cut down. We've got 120 of them over here. Um, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to beat that record. And... You know, part of the rules of this competition that I'm in right now is that I've got to get everything on the ground. That way I can sell it. Because if it's on the ground and processed, then I can take it over and sell it, even if it's after 60 hours. So, that's what we're going to do today. In this episode right here, I am going to get every tree on the ground. I don't know how long it's going to take me. I wish I had super fly ability like PC players so I could look at the top of this and see how cool that looks. Because it's like... It's a big square in the sky right now. But the first thing we need to do is actually go over and pick out some equipment. Now, I'm thinking I'm going to use the exact same equipment that I used last time. So for the forestry, uh, for cutting down, I think I'm going to go ahead and use the Scorpion King right here. It's a little bit cheaper, and I've got a few more options with it. Now it's not as powerful. Well, actually it is. Yeah, this is what we're going to do. Um, I'm going to go ahead and customize this thing up, though, because I want to have a little bit of fun. Um, let's go orange on that, and this. We're going to go green. There we go. It may not look the prettiest, but it's really nice to me. So, I'm not too worried about the wheels. Um, protection, no. I'm not going to need lights. I'm not going to be in it this long. So, engine... 385. Yep, that's the one we're doing right here. And sun protection, no. And beacon lights, no. So we are going to lease this. That's all we're doing. Um, I shouldn't have it more than, I mean, four hours. So at most, this is going to cost me... A little bit over $50,000. So, a lot better than trying to buy and then resell it. I don't think I'd make that money back at all. So here we go. We're going to lease this one. And that's all I need right now. So we're going to hop in this thing and we are going to get over here and get going. So like I said, I'm going to be playing a little bit different music for you guys today. Um, one of my competitors goes by the name of Crazy Monkey Gaming found some some more music that we can all use in our videos. So I'm definitely going to be taking advantage of that and uh, trying to stay away from this bird also for sure. So one thing I do need to do is pull up my menu here and I need to go ahead and Make sure everything is working. There we go. Alright, perfect. I think I want to stay about right there. And I want this about there. 
All right. So what time is it? 4.15. Or 2. 2.15. 14.15 is what time it is. So. All right, everybody. So what I'm planning on doing is just running right down this. Right in between. But I want my boom. Over here. All right, so now it is 14:16. I'm gonna go ahead and get started here, and uh, I don't know. Let's let's just cut a couple, okay? We'll we'll cut a couple for sure. Oop, wrong way. Yeah, I'm gonna do this. And I want it a little bit closer because I don't want that train to come get me. Oh, I did it in one. Hold on, I gotta fix that. That. That's not good. I'm going to go 10, 10 meters here. Yeah. All right, so here we go. So I'm hoping that these things don't go crazy on me. Am I really going to have just a bunch of little pieces like that? Ah. All right. It's all good. All right, so let's go get the next one. I guess if I wouldn't have cut that one so short, I'd been all right, right? All right, so this is what I'm gonna be doing for a while, guys. And by doing them in 10 meters, as you can see, they should be spaced out pretty well here. <laughs> and I can, uh, ooh, I should have got farther down on that one. I lost a little bit there. All right, so yeah, as you can see, by spacing them out 10, 10 meters, the trees, I, uh, sorry, trying to focus and do two things at once, and it isn't working out very well. Well, that definitely isn't the way that I wanted to go with that. So what we're going to do, ooh, I don't want that right there because that, well, this might take a little bit longer than I thought. It's all right, though. We'll get it. We will get it. I just don't want these out there for that train to hit. Like that bale, I do not want these to go flying like that bale did. I don't know if you guys remember that or not. It was not pretty. Maybe I need to approach this a different way. Oh. Maybe I need to come over to the other end. And start doing them. Just laying them out straight. This way. So, I'm going to get to this. I do not want you guys to be uh, having to hear this bird the entire time. So, I will go ahead and let you go. And I'm going to go ahead and time lapse this.
All right, so one thing that I need to do really quickly is I need to go grab a stump grinder. Oh, did I not? Mm. I must have not added it in here. I have one. All right, we're going to have to go find it and use it. And the reason is because I want to get these stumps out of the way as I go. That way, when I come back to pick up, everything's nice and easy. And I don't have all those stumps in my way. So, what I'm going to do is this one here. Because it's just sitting right there. I'm hoping I can tap it, tap it like that and get it out of here. You know, that good old farm sim physics? I don't think I am. Alright. Plan B. Oh, I forgot to show you guys all the stats, didn't I? Holy cow. I probably didn't even end with last time, I think. So here, let's do this really quick. So, money. I want you guys to see that I do not have any property income there at the very bottom. It's a big zero. That's cheats. Um, we got 136,000. Almost 137. Um, we're doing pretty good so far, I think. Um, on statistics, we're at 55.59. Uh, we have already played 18 minutes today. So I'm right at 56 hours, which means I have four hours remaining. So I think I'm doing okay. Zero missions completed. We've already cut down 14 trees. That's awesome. All right, on this, we've got everything as it should be. The last uh, four things, weeds, lime, plowing, and crop destruction are all turned on. Um, traffic's on, economic difficulty normal, and... Real time, yeah, I can't go above times five right now. And then general settings, euros, kilometers, hectares. So that's it, everybody. I'm going to go ahead and grab these couple items right here. And we are going to go back over there and hopefully do this quickly. I thought I had another stub grinder loaded in here. And I'm kicking myself that I don't now. But hopefully I can get this thing um, done in a reasonable amount of time. If it's going to take too long, I'm just going to not worry about it. But I was really, really hoping to be able to do this. I think this is going to take way too much time. I at least need them flush with the ground. That's honestly all I care about right now. A little bit too far on that one. Alright, well I'm going to time lapse this. And I will see you guys in a minute.
All right, everybody. I went and grabbed that mod really, really quick. So we're gonna go over here, and we're gonna go find it, cause I, I, I need to go faster. So force recruitment. Here we go. Here it is. Yes, this one. Main killer. Yeah, I want to be able to see it. Now standard or work light. I just need standard. All right, there we go. Perfect. All right. Uh, da, 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 da. So I think I'm just going to use the same tractor. Go over there and uh, and do it. So if I've got this other one, I can sell this one. Sounds like a plan. Get the tractor away from here a little bit. Repair it. Yeah. Oh, I'm going to get $4,000. I've been in this game 18 days. Holy cow. Alright, let's go pick this other one up. Hopefully it does it a little bit better. Private PTO on the front, yes. That's what I want. PTO on the front. Look at those beautiful colors. Red and blue. Red and blue. Alright. So I've never used this before. Let's try it out. So it looks like all I need to do is turn it on. Ooh, can I not go any higher than that? Or that might be a problem. Ooh, there we go. Perfect. I just have to like run up on top of them. Oh, look how much better that is. So much better. If I can just leave it down and just climb over them. Now I can't even move like that. Not on the front anyway. Like I said, if I don't get them all the way out, as long as they're flush with the ground, that'll be alright. Sorry if that's a little loud, everybody. All right, perfect. So we're going to get this back out of the way, and then we'll get started on the next one. So, we've got two rows done, which are 12 trees each. So we're 20% complete for this. Um, which I don't think is too bad. I'm gonna park this right here. Considering we've only been going um, 16, 26, 36, 26 minutes. It's about 13 minutes, about a minute a piece is the average right now, but I mean, I've done some other stuff and things. So, hopefully we can uh, increase 
I decrease that time a little bit here in the next few and I think with that what I just did there is gonna help me be able to decrease some of my time my uh, processing stumps time ooh that did not do what I wanted it to so we're gonna do that alright y'all I am going to go ahead and time lapse this in a second.
All right, sorry about that, everybody. Um, I'm sure you could tell it was uh, starting to lag really, really bad. So what I need to do is, yeah, you can tell right here. But what I need to do is go ahead and grab a truck and a trailer and a way to load all of these. So let's look here. Now, under forestry equipment, um, I've got the logger and the tracks. That one I think is a little bit too far apart. I think I've used that one before. So that one has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And this one has that. Can I? I'm not there. I'm not there. Yeah, I don't like that one. I think this is the one I'm going to go for. And I, I think I can get in there pretty easy, right in the middle. Alright, so this is the one. Um, main color really quick. We are going to, obviously, we just got to do it all. Do it all right. Alright, so, yep, we got a lease. There we go. Alright, so there's that. Now we come over here. We need a truck. I've been tempted to get this one because it's only 75. a little bit long and I'm worried about the exhaust see that one's really short and I can get it turned around and maneuvered really really easy and I'm not worried about the, the cost so we're going to once again Make everything match. All right, there's that. Now, how am I going to get these on it? Yeah, we're going to use this guy again. Nah, we'll stick with this. All right, there's that. Yep, and now we need something to actually grab it. Thought about this, but it doesn't look like it's gonna work. So, wait, wheel loaders, here we go. Yep, this is the one. Alright, so design color. Alright, lease. Alright, let's uh... The first thing we need to do is get this over there and get them picking up, right? Trying to get them organized a little bit without too much lag and if it starts getting really laggy what I'll do is I'm just gonna cut and then um, show you guys what happened after that that was interesting after that So, as you guys can see, we did cut down four rows of trees. Oh yeah, real laggy. Alright, so... Let me back up over here where it's not laggy. Alright, so everybody, what I'm going to do, I'm not trying to play any funky games or anything like that. I cut down way too many trees and piled them up. 
Um, I'm going to go ahead and do a jump cut till you guys see all this uh, cleared up. Let's go ahead and look at my money right now so you guys can see exactly where everything's going to go. Alright, so on finances, you can see that, you know, this is what it is. 4,038 on sold vehicles, negative 12 on running costs, negative 37,704 on vehicle leasing costs. If I keep coming down, positive 31,315 for sold bales, negative 900 for seed, negative 5760 for fertilizer, negative 2539 for a wage payment. So that's where I'm at right now. Um, we'll go over and look at stats also as you can see 24 trees cut down zero missions you know all of that so I'm gonna go in and uh, straighten these up and like I said it's gonna be a jump cut because I don't want you guys to have to deal with that lag anymore um, it's bad enough on my part you guys don't need to deal with that so I will see you all if it gets better I'll come back um, hopefully it does. All right, everybody. I uh, I had to switch up the plan a little bit. Um, I gotta go with this. That other one, it was. I just couldn't get it up in the trailer. Couldn't maneuver it at all. So we're gonna use this. And uh, as you can see, I didn't get very far. So, all right.
All right, everybody. It's getting a lot better over here now with the uh, the lag and everything. So I'm gonna bring you guys along for the journey now. Yay! We've only got about I don't know 40 more logs to pick up here, but we're gonna try and do this without getting taken out by the train, which might prove to be a challenge on a couple of these logs. But this one's almost full. I think I'm going to try and get these these two and then two more on it. And then we're going to be good to go. Now I've got to figure out a way to pick up all these little bitty sticks. I mean, I don't know how much they're worth. But and the way I'm going now, I think I need every penny. I will say, no matter what, it has been fun and challenging to do this uh, battle royale. I'm not a big fan of little bitty maps, but this one, uh, this one isn't too bad. I've been able to do my style of stuff on it still, just not as big. I mean, when my biggest tractor is typically my smallest, one of my smallest tractors. That's when you know it's a small map. All right, am I gonna be able to get it and keep it? I think so. Perfect. I wonder if we're gonna see a, a half a million up there before You know, I even start selling anything else. That would be quite impressive, I think. We can get a couple more on there. Yeah, let's go grab a couple right over here. I think a real challenge to this would be doing it all in cab. We should we should make that a challenge, everybody. The in cab challenge. Everything. Everything from inside the cab. And that, I don't know how well that one would go. You know, I think the biggest thing about this is we want to make content that people are going to enjoy to watch. Oh, man. Right, that's that was one of the biggest reasons for this challenge, was to help get some attention to our channels. And... I think it's done that. I mean, I, I know two of the participants have just uh, shown that their you know subs have increased to a level that they I don't know are like you know overly ecstatic about. But I mean, it, it's it's really really good. It was their goals, right? Or very very close to their goals already. So, um, and I'm not trying to downplay anything at all. It's when you're at the numbers that they are, it's very, very, very difficult. Um, and you just have to really, really dig. Um, every one of us has been there. You know, and we'll, we'll tell you that it's, unless you know, you know, a couple hundred people that are willing to subscribe to you right off the bat, getting those first 100, 200 are our chore. And then once you get past that, you know, you, you know what you're doing, you know what you want, what your audience wants, and you, you run with it, right? You build, it's exponential, and you go with those first few till you figure out who you are as a content creator and what you want your channel to be and everything like that. That is, it's a test. I mean, there's a reason that, you know, it takes 1,000 subs and 4,000 hours of content watched a year to be able to get into that program. So, I mean, they're doing great. Their stuff, Crazy Monkey, his his content is, I wish he had more time. I really do. I really wish he had more time to be able to uh, um, make content. Um, 
I think his new series is going to be really, really cool. Or his new, I don't even want to call it a series. His new project, how about we say that, is going to be really, really cool. Um, so be on the lookout for Crazy Monkey stuff. And he's linked in the description here down below. So go ahead and uh, go check him out. Check out all the stuff he's done with this competition here. You know, you can check out the rest of his channel. Everything. Um, you know, and then uh, Red Viking. He's got a, uh, a Sussex contract series going on right now that he's having, I mean, a pretty good amount of time on. He's, he's getting and he's playing seasons and he hasn't been able to spend a whole lot of time because of this competition. But I think that's going to pick back up for him here really soon. And, uh, you know, we got Klopatel also. Klopatel was kind of like the, I don't, I don't want to say the wild card. We just didn't know much about him, about his channel and everything. We saw that it was a lot of, I saw that it was like a lot of time lapse and things like that, which aren't bad at all. I mean, time lapse are really, really cool. And, you know, he informed us um, that he has been away or out of the country and is not going to be able to uh, finish participating in the competition. And it, it really stinks. I and mean, I was really looking forward to seeing some more content from everybody. You know, and uh, I think it's going to be pretty close on who uh, who gets this mug. So I'm going to run over here, grab this one, put it where it goes, stop yapping, and I'm going to go ahead and start time lapsing everybody. Um, I honestly don't know how long this episode is going to be. I just want it to be to hour 60, and then after 60, I'm going to do another one to finish off. So that's uh, what I'm looking for here is just getting to hour 60. That way I know that competition is done, and then we will uh, finish off the rest of it on one more. So, like I said, I'm going to time lapse now and uh, enjoy the music.
I mean, I guess the good news is, is that we have 40% done. Okay. That's the good news. So, let's take a, uh, a quick look here. So, we, uh, we've made $336,000 on wood almost. That's exciting. And... 58.29. I have an hour and a half left. That's not too bad then. I can, I can make a really good dent in that. We've cut down 24 trees so far. How only 24? Oh, no. This session, 24. And I had some from before. So. Yeah. Okay. Well, I'm going to cut down a couple rows here. And then uh, we'll pick them up. So I'm on time lapse it. All right, everybody. I actually just checked while I was uh, doing a little quick editing. And this episode is already about an hour long right now. So I'm going to go ahead and stop it. We're going to have a part two of cutting down the Christmas trees. I still have, what, one, two, three, four, five, six rows to go. So six rows to go. And I looked at it a while ago. And I could cut a row of 12 trees in under 8 minutes. So, I'm, I'm going to do two at a time. I think that's the way I'm going to go. Two at a time. Cut them down. Get the stumps out of the way. Cut it down. Get the stumps out of the way. And then I'll uh, just keep making my way. Um, I'm hoping I can get all of them done. I mean, I might you know, drag some of them over there. Leave them. Put some here. And then over there, because the rule says as long as they're on the ground and prepped. I don't even know if it says prepped, but I'm going to get them on the ground and prepped at least and then take them all. So I just want to say thank you all for stopping in. This has been an adventure. I hope you guys enjoyed the music. We're going to have some more of it in the next episode too. Um, but I'm going to go and get off here. That way I can save a little bit more time. And it's um, 5 o'clock, so I'm going to be ending right about 7, a little bit before like 6.30 in game time. So daylight still, but... I'm going to get out of here. I'm going to go look at this cool stick that's just hanging out by itself. Balancing. I'm not going to touch it. But if you liked what you saw today, go ahead and give me a thumbs up if you would. If you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and check out my other stuff and see if it's something you'd be interested in. Got a lot of people in here right now that uh, you know, are enjoying the content. Um, and uh, you know, if you want to leave a comment, go right ahead. I'm enjoying the conversations. And if you want to share, go right ahead. Also, I'm never going to tell you no, you can't share one of my episodes, playlists, channel, whatever you want to do. So until next time, everybody, this is Driver53, signing off.